Hello, Georgia Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. This card I found on Pinterest and I thought it was really pretty. So I cased it. Um, the lady, I don't know her name, who done it, um, did them in all different colours. And I picked the yellow one to do here. And now I'm going to show you in bottom blue. So for that you'll need a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths scored and folded in half. A piece of balmy blue um, card at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. A piece of white cardstock at five and a half by three and three quarters. A piece of white at five and a half, uh, five and five eighths by three and seven eighths for the inside, and some scrap for the butterflies and the circle. I have cut out the circle. I have cut out uh, four circles, just in case I make a mistake. I also use some gold thread on this one, but on the one I'm going to make today, I'm going to use the silver thread. Get that out ready. And the colour inks I'm going to use are Barmy Blue and Blushing Bride, as well as black for the butterfly, which will stamp first so they can dry so I can colour them in. Oh, the stamp sets, right. Butterfly Gala for the butterflies, I'm going to use them too. Hello Cupcake for the sentiment, celebrate your day and Beauty Abound for the bubbles. I'm going to use both sizes. So let's stamp the butterflies. So we want one big one. and a small one. Right, put them to one side. And oh, my cloth's not very wet. Wet enough for now, I'll clean them properly afterwards. Oh, we need that for Celebrate your day. Right, see so if I can get this on without messing it up. But if I do, I've got four. And look at that. If I didn't have four, I bet you any money I would have messed that up. Alright. Now for the, let's get that out of the way, front. And we're going to use Blushing Bride and Balmy Blue. I'm going to get a wet wipe. Seems as my cloth's not very wet. So with the big spots, what I did was just randomly stamped some dots. some little ones. That's come out green. And the little ones are blue. Weird. Right. 
weird. Anyway. The Blushing Bride. I'm going to do it that way. And one in there. And one there. I'm not going to put a big one. I'll put a couple of little ones. And that is all I've done. So I went from corner to corner and then off in one colour and then the opposite corners in another colour. anymore. I do like that. So what do we do now? We put some dimensionals on this. No, let's stick this on here first. We did bubbles on the inside. Oh, I did bubbles on the inside. Did I? I did. So, open my inks up again. I did. That's all I did. So the last colour I used, yellow and cross Korean Highland Heather. I'll right, we'll stick this one inside. some dimensionals and our silver thread let's take these backings off first your fingers without the knots that should do I'm 
take it off and squish it together and place it on the um, sentiment and then you just place that in the middle That looks pretty already, doesn't it? So, let's get this out of the way. Stop the nets, they've got, they come off my brushes. Just stops them from unraveling. Now, at the butterfly, all I did was colour in, bl in blue, just one colour, nothing fancy. This is dark. A small one. That is it. That's all I done. Then I cut it out using the punch. And the little one as well. And then what I do need to do is add some bodies, which I never got out. So this is the big butterfly's body and we want the little butterfly's body And then I just folded the wings up and stuck them down with some glue on and I'm going to put that on under there. And the little one. I'm going to put down there. What 
else I need to do is add the antennae or antennas for the big butterfly. Let's get this out of the way for now. even know these stumps were in it till the other day. Just shows you how much I look at my stamps. Now I won't get antenna on for the butterfly but what I could do is draw just one in. I'll we'll do that there. The other one's under the sentiment. Now, oh, all we've got to do now is add some gems. Which I've got here. just scattered yeah, three so I'm going to put one there one there and one there I've got that one and go there. That's it. So there you have it. I think that's quite pretty. That I like that colour. Well, if you like it, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my videos, please subscribe um, and press the notification button next to it and you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thank you for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.